hi guys welcome to my channel my name is alicia and you are watching alicia the military spouse if you guys are new here thank you so much for clicking on my channel um i'm a military spouse and my husband and i and our three kids were stationed in england so if you guys would like to continue to see us on our journey to see all the things that we um go and look at and go to visit just make sure that you guys um subscribe to my channel so you guys don't mix out Okay, so we made it to Birmingham. Now, as you guys can see, when we left, it was all nice and sunny. By the time we made it here, it was raining. So at first I wasn't really tripping because I'm like, all right, it's like light rain. So it wasn't really a big deal. Um, sorry if y'all hear a dog barking, like my window's open and I guess it's a neighbor's dog. But anyway, so um, it was raining and um we had every intention on the only reason why we really came to birmingham is to take my daughter to like the um hello kitty cafe which you guys will see here in a little bit but um we also had plans of taking her to the aquarium well we thought we were just going to be able to like get tickets and go and which we were able to get tickets but the times like it was just too late in the day than what we were trying to do um we were trying to like kind of get out that morning and all of that stuff but we weren't able to so we had to walk from our room to primart which is where hello kitty cafe is and so um it turned into like a 20 minute walk which was like i said it was okay but then like y'all it started raining so hard so by the time we made it in here we were kind of drenched but it wasn't bad so here's the hello kitty cafe or here's the little hello kitty section where they have the clothes and the hello kitty cafe is back there and like guys it was so much fun the food was good the clothes and this primark was like one of the biggest primarks i think they said or something like that but yeah like this primark had all of this look at that cute little hello kitty stuff and i end up buying me like some sweatpants and my daughter got some things that you guys will see here later on in the video too but y'all like it was just so nice and my daughter absolutely loved it So this is one of the milkshake i think it's called like a pink kitty milkshake or something i don't know but it looks so good it has a donut on top and of course i had to go back and give me one because i was like you know what that looks really good at first i was just going to get coffee to warm up but you know and these waffles those waffles were delicious delicioso like for real and those pork buns those were really good too so um they also have like a disney cafe we didn't go inside the cafe um this time we just kind of looked by looked looked around or whatever looked inside and it was really cool too because like i said our sole purpose was to take it to the hello kitty cafe so we just i think it's like three stories and i think this may, might be the third story so we went up to look at the disney cafe and y'all like after this like my makaya the middle one she saw an umbrella and she wanted the umbrella and she just started flipping out so that kind of like killed our trip but um like i told you guys it was raining so we had to end up so we stopped inside of a mall and i saw like this really pretty like picture here and i thought that was really dope so you guys about to say look at all that rain <laughs> so my son had got drenched like before we walked that's why we stopped in that mall to get kind of like dry off and to you know reassess because i'm like at this point i'm like okay we're gonna have to do something like it was just bad nobody had an umbrella i can't believe that i did not pack my umbrella and that's one thing they always say is when you come to england or wherever you go make sure that you always pack an umbrella or something like that because the weather can literally change at any moment but i was trying my best to like just how oh, y'all it was so pretty there like all of the architecture there the buildings like it was just the statues like it was so pretty so i was really trying to capture everything but the rain was you know falling in my face and i was trying to hurry up and i felt like the walk was taking so long but look at that waterfall back there y'all like it was just so nice so i'm trying to capture everything to, to show you guys but it was really really hard
I had to get the picture of the wing stop because I was like, look at the wing stop and these bulls, like, I think it's called the Bull Center. So like there were plenty of bulls all over the place. That's just the one that we were able to get pictures of. And like y'all, like everything was just so pretty there. Like look at all of those statues. Look at that. And that was one of my favorite the gold men and y'all look at this that says victoria square that was like it has something about the princess of wales in 1993 or something like i don't know it was really really dope and i was like are you serious saw kyoto ugly like it was just really nice so we finally make it back to the hotel like we were so drenched by this time that i was just like you know what I didn't even like I was going to like go show you guys like what everything looked like but I was so tired that I was just like you know what let's just get out of these clothes and dry everybody off so here are just pictures of the the cafe like more pictures that my daughter took but yeah like we was just being out in that rain I was like nah let's just get all of our clothes off let's get dry let's find out where we're going to eat and that was it because I just couldn't deal so this is the next day and we're actually well the next morning we're actually headed back um to where we stay here in on on base so I'm just going to show you guys you know I drive um back Y'all see how the sky clearing up and the sun trying to come out? Like, I was so mad because this was the day that we were going to take her to the aquarium. But like I said, we couldn't get tickets. Like, we, I mean, all night we're trying to, like, figure out, okay, like, what can we do? Can we stay? Like, we just did not want to stay, like, get out of there super duper late. We were trying to, we wanted to take her to the aquarium, but we didn't want to go to the aquarium, like, at around three like we were trying to come back around that time and the only times they were offering were like two and three so we just told her that it's another one um i think it's called sea life center or something like that but it's another one that's closer to where we stay that's only like an hour away so um we are trying to work that out and try to take her to um to that aquarium and so you know i mean it is what it is she wasn't trip she was a little bum but she was okay so this is the next day and we are actually headed to bury um and we're gonna go to the prime market in bury because that one just opened up i want to say maybe a month ago and i haven't been yet so um we were like okay well let's just go to the art because she always like going to the art because it's always so many different things that you can do there and she you know she enjoys it so we're going to the art in bury um and yeah
Yeah, so after we left Primark, we just continued to walk down because um, I think it's like farmers markets and stuff like that that's um, on the other street. So this is just somewhere that people come. It's like an outdoor, I don't want to call it an outdoor mall, but an outdoor shopping center type thing. So we like to go there because then you see all of these different shops that are set up and they're selling different things and they just have a lot of cool stuff. I haven't really had the time to just stop and look at everything because m more when we just two times that we've been here i vlog so i'm trying to like capture everything for you guys that i'm kind of having a hard time trying to literally like actually see what's there um so like they have a lot of like different little shops that i want to check out because i think they have like this antique spot that you guys will see later on in the video that was really dope they had some like pillows they just have everything fresh flowers for fruit vegetables like it's just it really happens like in berry like everything be going down there so this is a bakery that bakery is really good too they had like these croissants that we got that taste like cake i don't know what kind of croissants they were because i wasn't there when my husband ordered them but yeah they were really good but i'm just showing you guys like all of the different booths and all of the shops and everything that are set up here um whenever you come to berry So, of course, my princess wanted to go into Claire's with both of my princesses, but only one of them knew really what she was <laughs> wanted to do. But she just wanted to look around and see what was in there. And I was just trying to keep Micaiah from taking anything and breaking anything. But, yeah, this is like um, it was a really cute Claire's. So now we're going to walk out and i don't even remember where we went oh yeah this is like one of the little antique spots that i was kind of telling you guys about and then they have um on down they have like some rugs like the next shop they have like rugs there but um i like those rugs but they're just a little bit too bright but yeah they have like pillows there they have books there like i wanted to actually go in there and look but it's just really hard like with the kids and all of that stuff so yeah um whenever we get more time i'm definitely going to stop by and they look at those flowers like i love fresh flowers but i have not bought any which is weird i don't know why i haven't bought any fresh flowers and they're cheap they're probably like three pounds so look at that when she's starting to cry but yeah like that is just it's just so many different things there
y'all look at Arya's face look at her face like she always i don't know what <laughs> i guess because she's 10 and she feels like she's so much older and these are like little kitty rides so when she just does not <laughs> like she just be really trying to fight yeah, having Micaiah. fun but yeah we made her ride it with her brother and Makaya is over there in one of the other cars and I was just laughing because I was like look at her she is such a fun snatcher <laughs> Okay, so I want to show you guys what we got from Primark yesterday, the one in Birmingham, and then what stuff we got today. So this is from our daughter, um, the middle one, Makaya. Got her this little cute Chippendale sweater with these pants. Um, and then I think that's all we got her from the one yesterday. My son. My husband said my son had this shirt that he wouldn't let go. This <laughs> little Hawaiian shirt. And then we got him like um, two packs of shorts. So um, I also got me some Hello Kitty sweatpants. There. Y'all, these things are so comfortable. And then um, the little Hello Kitty shirt that I thought was really cute. My daughter is already saying that she wants this, but I'm like, girl, you're not getting it no time soon because I keep giving her all of my clothes that I can't fit. Anyway, so I went to Primark today in um, Barry St. Edmunds and my daughter wanted this hat. I don't know why, but she wanted that. And then we got her this shirt. That was only like a pound. These two shirts here were only like, only like a pound and or something like that. And then we got her some shorts because remember I told y'all she doesn't have like a lot of shorts. So I just picked up a few of those, and those are only like two pounds, like a little over two pounds. Let's see, two pounds, 50 pence, I think is what they call it. And then my husband got my son, of course. His name is Miles. I got him a little Spider Man unit with the pants to go with it. And I think, I think that's all. Oh, my oldest, she got um, a Hello Kitty, she took it up already, but she got a Hello Kitty sweatshirt. That's the color of these pants. I think she just actually got the sweat top that goes with these pants. I just didn't get them. And then yesterday she has like this Hello Kitty blanket. And then she got some socks. So yeah, this about rounds up everything that we got for my little spring break vacay. And like I said, we went to Primark today just because we never we haven't been to the one in Barrie. So we just wanted to go and check it out. But I'm not feeling good because we were like walking in the rain. So I'm about to drink some Theraflu. I need to clean, but I don't want to. But I'm about to take the Theraflu and um, lay down. Well, I'm gonna try to lay down. But anyway, I'll talk to you guys later. Bye.